It's very important because sun plays an important role in the future of the Earth. Earth. I think Earth is all because of sun. But activities on sun is well studied today and the solar eruptions, the solar activity do affect the uh, outer planet atmosphere. The Aditya L1 mission, India's inaugural space-based solar observatory developed by the Indian Space Research Organization or ISRO, is scheduled for launch on September 2nd from Sri Harikota. The spacecraft will be positioned in a hollow orbit encircling the first Lagrange point L1 of the Sun-Earth system situated approximately 1.5 million kilometers away from Earth as per ISRO's announcement. Let us now delve into what is the L1 point where the spacecraft will be placed and what will come out of the mission. Why study the Sun? Each celestial body, be it planet like Earth or an exoplanet situated outside the solar system, goes through a developmental process influenced by its host star. The conditions and surrounding of the star impact the overall state of the system. Fluctuations in these conditions can lead to alterations in satellite trajectories, potentially reducing their operational lifespans, disrupting or harming internal electronics, and triggering power outages and other disruptions on Earth. Acquiring information about solar phenomena is essential for comprehending space-related environmental conditions. We decided that it is important to study moon much more closer, unobstructed, continuously for 24 hours a day. Uh, a, a day. So this is possible only from space. So we thought that we should put an observatory in space to look at moon, sun over a long period of time. Where will Aditya L1 mission go? The space vehicle will be placed into orbit around the L1 Lagrange point. This location will enable it to have an unobstructed view of the Sun. A Lagrange point, according to NASA, represents a spot in space where the gravitational forces of two substantial bodies precisely counterbalance the centripetal force necessary for a small object to travel with them. In simple terms, this point in space is utilized by spacecrafts to minimize the amount of fuel required to maintain their position. According to NASA, the L1 point of the Earth-Sun system affords an uninterrupted view of the Sun and is currently home to the Solar and Heliospheric Observatory Satellite or SOHO. What will the mission study? The space vehicle transports seven instruments designed to examine the photosphere, chromosphere and outer layers of the Sun. These instruments encompass detectors for electromagnetic waves, particles and magnetic fields. Among the seven instruments, four are focused on directly investigating the Sun, while the other three will analyze particles and fields at the L1 Lagrange point. Aditya L1 payloads are expected to provide the most crucial information to understand the problem of coronal heating, coronal mass ejection, pre-flare and flare activities and their characteristics, dynamics of space weather, propagation of particle and fields, etc., according to ISRO. It's very important because sun plays an important role in the future of the Earth. Earth I think Earth is all because of sun. But activities on sun is well studied today and the solar eruptions, the solar activity do affect the uh, outer planet atmosphere.